The Legend of Tarzan in 3D. A 2016 release, a 1 hour and 50 minute film, a 2.35 to 1 aspect ratio, and it says the best possible Tarzan for our time. Is that true? Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Uh, directed by David Yates. Hats off to David Yates. Great job on the directing here. Alexander Skarsgård as Tarzan. I may have mispronounced that. Excuse me. Margaret Robbie as Jane. Margaret Robbie as Jane. Uh, Christopher Waltz as Leon, the villain, and Samuel L. Jackson as George Washington Williams. So what do we got here? We got a very different Tarzan. This is a, this takes place right after the Civil War. There's a little bit of spoilers here, a little bit of spoilers. I'm just going to give you a little bit about the plot first. It takes place after the Civil War. Tarzan's living the, the lap of luxury, married to Jane, uh, well-to-do, wealthy person. Uh, they don't have any children yet. Um, he gets invited to go back to Africa, but it's a trap because um, there's a company out there trying to expand into Africa and capture the, to build up the Congo, but they're failing. Um, and so they have to get some diamonds and things in here to go ahead and, and, and there's somebody that wants Tarzan back in Africa and they're willing to pay diamonds, which will rescue this company. Uh, yeah, it's, it's a good plot. A solid plot, solid storyline in here. I got to tell you that right now. So that's a little bit about the movie. Um, that's basically the plot. Tarzan's going back with Samuel L. Jackson to Africa. To, in their mind, they're going to stop the slave trade. And then somebody wants to deliver Tarzan to somebody so that he can hurt him and gather some diamonds up and rescue his company financially. So that's that. Um, let's talk a little bit about Alexander Skarsgård. Does he pull off Tarzan? He does a great job, great job, great physique on this guy. Very handsome guy, this Alexander Skarsgård. There's also two other actors that play Tarzan, one when he's 18 and one when he's five. If you want to know who those actors are, go ahead and Google it. Margaret Robbie is Jane. Oh my gosh, the beautiful Margaret Robbie. Oh, she's just absolutely beautiful in this movie. And she's just something about her. It's just, oh, this movie, she's... Wet hair, wet dress, handcuffed to the rail of a steamship. So vulnerable. You just want to jump through the screen and be her Tarzan and rescue her. Tarzan's off somewhere else and can't help her at the time. And her captors are, you just, you know, it's, oh, she just, and she's spunky in this. She's spunky. She uh, resists her captors, uh, has some, some sharp lines in here. Uh, she has a great romantic interest with Tarzan. Of course, they're married, but the romance in here is really good with Tarzan and, and Jane. Uh, a lot of backstory in here. That's what really makes this. You get the backstory to Tarzan. And somebody has said that the backstory was kind of short. The backstory is throughout the whole movie. The backstory is throughout the whole movie. How, 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 how he came to be in the jungle, um, how he met Jane, and how they got out of there. Uh, all that backstory is mixed in and it does a great job. Let's talk a little about the cinematography. The cinematography is incredible. The, 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 the low camera angles, the slow motion, uh, the scenery, the panoramic stuff, the jungle scenes. It's all oh, the cinematography. Hats off to David Yates and, and, and the director of photography and this, whoever he was. I forgot who that was. Um, so let's talk about the 3D now. How's the 3D? It's good. The 3D is good. I mean, you put your glasses on, it's in 3D. Um, but would I rather watch it in 3D and 2D? Absolutely. Is it phenomenal 3D? No. Is it reference quality 3D? No. Is this something you, to, that your friend comes over, he's never seen 3D, and you're going to pop it and say, hey, look at this 3D, look how does this look? No. But for us seasoned guys, us 3D viewers, we'd much rather watch it this way. Um, there's some depth. There's some, they missed a lot of opportunities here, i got to say that. There are some pop-outs uh, that will surprise you. Um, a butterfly comes floating out of the screen, which is pretty good. It doesn't come too far out, but it, that, that's, it's a single butterfly. Near the end, in the third act, is when they put the money into the 3D. Um, they, they have some explosions. There are some action scenes. There are some, a couple of things flying out of the screen at you. Not much, just a couple. And there's one really particular pop-out that has to do with a necklace. And that's all I'm going to say. And, man, it really pops out. It comes into the room. But... If they'd have made all the 3D like that, this would have been an incredible, incredible 3D uh, adventure. Unfortunately, they didn't. Um, so if, let me tell say, say one more thing about this movie. I want to say this. So that's the 3D. If I got one word for this movie, it's intense. This movie is extremely intense. 
And a lot of the reviewers said that there was something missing. I want to say this. There is something missing. And I couldn't put my finger on it because it was so intense. And the music going with the intensity of it. And brutal. Very brutal. Very brutal here. Very brutal Tarzan movie. What was missing? And I have to say, what keeps this from being an epic would be there's not there's no joy. It's not fun. You know, I mean, there's no fun. There's no, it's, it's just intense brutality and an intense story, which keeps you riveted. I mean, I was going to pop this in for 20 minutes and take it out. Couldn't turn it off. Uh, it's more of a man's, I want to say a man's man movie, but I think it is. You know, I think it is. I think the guys are going to enjoy this more. Uh, you will see a lot of animals in here and everything. Um, the music score works well. Uh, I didn't have to mess with my volume much, so that worked out really good. But the brutality and the intensity, there's a joy and a fun that's missing. Now, there's a good, you know, at the end, it, it's a good ending. You know, like Wizard of Oz, that was a good ending. There's a good ending in here. Uh, it's, it's not a sad ending. It's not a movie that's going to make you feel uh, sad at the end. It makes you feel good at the end. But all through the movie, it's very intense. But it's very good if you like good action drama you like being out in the jungle you like africa and you like tarzan i think you're going to enjoy this i really do so here's my take on this tarzan for the movie itself four out of five stars for the 3d 3.75 out of five i think they could have done a little bit better job with that a little bit better pop out so let me ask you what'd you think Did you see it Did you see it in 3d Did you see it in 2d Did you see that at the theaters uh Leave some comments below and let me know. Hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on any uh, upcoming reviews. I want you to stay safe. God bless. Have a good night. Hit that like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any upcoming reviews. Take care and we'll see you on the next one.